Hello everyone. In this video, we will see how to make a field read only using ACLs in ServiceNow. So this will be a very straightforward example where we will be looking at a field on the incident table which we will make read only. So the agenda of our video would be create an ACL to make category field on incident table read only for everyone except admin role. So for example, if someone has an admin role, they should be able to edit the category field and any other person shouldn't be able to do that. So let's quickly go into service now and see how can we do that. I'm in my service now instance and to create an ACL, you will first have to elevate your roles and you should be logged in as an admin. So I am logged in as an admin here and I will elevate my roles by clicking on elevate role and click on security admin and update. So you should be an admin as well as you should have security admin role in your service now instance. Only then you will be able to create or edit existing ACLs. If you see a little arrow on the profile picture, so that means elevate role has been activated for your profile. Now you can go ahead and create or update ACLs. Without this, you wouldn't be able to do that. I will type ACL here and it's marked as favorite. However, if you want to go and search in the application navigator under system security, you can find access control or ACL. I will go ahead and click on new. So I'll just close this screen. In the type, you have to select record and in the operation, you have to make the field read only. For that, you have to select write and you can consider admin overrides when you want admins to override this particular ACL in our condition we are already doing it for admin so it doesn't matter moving on in the name we have to select the table name so for that I will click on this and search for the table called incident and in the field I would be selecting category because we have to make that field read only so I will select this category and if you scroll down in the requires role I will go ahead and select admin role so now it means the admin role would be only able to write on the category field and if someone is not an admin, they wouldn't be able to do that. I will go ahead and save this and you would see it's adding security rule for this particular field. I will continue and now the ACL has been saved. So I'm logged in as an admin. I will go ahead and try to search for an incident and the category should come as in editable to me so for example i click on all and i click on this incident you would see the category is coming as editable to me so that's all right now we will log in as an itil user where i will go ahead and again test it whether this user is able to edit or not so i will click on itil here i will impersonate and here i will search for incident and i will click on all and I will click on the same incident number and here you would see the category is coming as read only. So any person who is not admin will not be able to see this field as editable. I hope you like this short video and short example of creating a very, very simple ACL. If you have any questions, please let me know in comments and please subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit that like button.